Americans should spend our hard-earned money to go and watch a subpar movie just because it has a female lead. The real plea is for men to have enough empathy to go see movies starring women. But where was her sympathy and her empathy when she was talking about those very same men and the lack of their penis size? She literally just tried to scream sexism and call out Steven Spielberg for not directing any movies with female leads, which is not true, by the way. But Elizabeth Banks is also a movie director. And guess who hasn't directed any movies with male leads? So when men direct movies with male leads, it's sexism. But when women direct movies with female leads, it's empowerment. So again, I have to ask, is this really about sympathy and inclusion? Or are you just trying to slang subpar movies and making us feel bad for not wanting to watch them. A the fuck would want to be a man. The only thing that would get me is a leg up in our system. And it's weird to me how y'all shit on women for wanting to get their hair and nails done, but yet if their toes aren't perfectly manicured, they're disgusting. Women don't need you for shit. Ew! And I got a flat tire, and so I pulled over. So, this is what you got out here talking about. Ew, she don't need a man. See what you done did, fellas? Mm-hmm. You done created a whole bunch of monsters out here. Ew. And called DoorDash support, and she told me that she's going to compensate me for half of the amount that was promised, and I can just keep the food. And she a DoorDash bum bitch. So, <laughs> I'm waiting on my boyfriend to come fix my flat, and... They're disgusting. Women don't need you for shit. Ew. Disgusting. Women don't need you for shit. Ew. So, <laughs> I'm waiting on my boyfriend to come fix my flat, and... His oh. So you're waiting on a man to come fix your flat. The same man you said you don't need. So <laughs> I'm waiting on my boyfriend to come fix my flat and... Historically and currently speaking, men have died by the hundreds of millions trying to build and maintain society for mostly the benefit of women and children. And how convenient is it for women that only after we have air conditioner and pizza in 20 minutes, they don't need us anymore? That's like me saying we don't need farmers be children. And how convenient is it for women that only after we have air conditioner and pizza in 20 minutes, they don't need us anymore? That's like me saying we don't need farmers because we can get our groceries from the store. And when you say you'd only want to be a man because men have a leg up in society, are you talking about the leg up that makes it so that men have 66 percent longer sentences for the same crime oh you're talking about the leg up that makes it so that women get custody of the children 92 percent of the time and 92 percent of all of the alimony paid out is paid out to women even though women make just as much as men Oh, okay, I get it now. You're talking about the leg up that makes it so that men are more likely to be victims of every single violent crime, 350% more likely to end themselves, and make up 70% of the homeless population. Okay, I think I get it now. You're talking about the leg up that makes it so that men comprise 92% of all workplace deaths, meaning men are more likely to die building society, while we also comprise 97% of all military deaths, meaning men are also more likely to die trying to protect that society, only for that society to hate him. Men sure do have a lot of advantages. Till next time.